Hey guys, Gizmo here, and we are going to play some Pokemon trading card game online. Now, I really got into this because we got back into the physical card game, which is really, really fun, by the way. But now, it's been, uh, oh, it's been since about 2000, I think. So, 15, 16 years ago, since the last time I played the trading card game, but with Pokemon Go, it's reignited my love for the game. So... I've been buying the physical cards again, me and my wife have had a lot of fun doing that. But, every time you buy physical cards now, you get boosters. And I think that's awesome. When you buy something physical, you get the digital to go with it. So, eh, might as well, right? And I gotta tell you, I've put a lot of time into this game. Now, overall, it's a pretty simple game. I mean, it's just... It's similar to Magic, similar to Hearthstone, if you've never played it before. Uh, the biggest difference, like I said, it's pay to win, obviously. If you have the better cards, you're going to win more. But, the fact that they actually give you little cards to do... And let me show you how easy it is to, uh, to put a card in. Now... You can do the QR reader, which if you're like me, I'm on Mac, so I have a built-in webcam that you're seeing me on right now. And the best way I've found to do it is to get about six inches away and look at that. It's that simple. You just kind of, boom. Oh, let me grab some more here. Now, I have noticed that the lighting has to be pretty decent for you to do this. And I've also noticed sometimes, which I said right now it's going super quick. Look at that. Oh, oh. If it doesn't scan right away, which for these it seems like it, it's really, really good. But if it doesn't scan right away, Take this last one back. Let's climb them. All you really got to do is kind of move them a little bit, like this right here. But the big thing is, you're going to want to get the code really, really close, like that. And that doesn't work. You need it back. At least, you know, take your hand and go to your wrist. You want it about that far away. And it's going to work so much better. Alright, so let's crack some packs. Now, this is my favorite part. This is so unrealistic. Who opens packs like that? You can't open packs like that. Everybody knows you pop them open. Ooh. Awesome. And our rare is a Charizard EX. Great. That's going to go great with today's mission. Let's open up another. Watch! Now, if you're not interested in anything else, this is great practice. Oh wow. Flurry on the EX. Boy, are we getting lucky on the EXs today. Holy cow. Two packs in a row. There's no way that's gonna hold up. It's gonna stop here. Yeah, yeah, we stopped. But Jinx, very cool card. This is great practice, and like I said, you're getting them for free, you might as well use them, right? Two rares this time? Ooh, a Gyarados and Hitmonlee. But if you wanna start doing tournament play, or you want to go down to your local shop and stuff on whatever day your Pokemon day is. I think a lot of them are Saturdays. This is great practice to see what works. Wow. What works and what doesn't. And since it's online, there's no way to cheat. There's no way to mess the rules up. So you're going to learn the rules really fast. And I like that too. It's really great for beginners. Holy cow, another EX. It's really great for beginners and advanced players alike. You become a better player, you build your decks out, and you can take them from online 
into a real place and really try them out. That's such a weird card. Alright, rare is... Meh. So enough of that. Now there are two currencies in this game. One is the Pokey Coins. What are they calling them? Pokey Tokens, I'm sorry. And then there are these tickets. Now the tickets are for the online tournament. But everything that you can buy in a store, you can pretty much buy here. You've got these little packs like here that you see at Walmart all the time that come with a coin a card and then a pack and then you've got just regular packs you've got all kinds of stuff you can get the decks I really want that one and you've got all kinds of little card sleeves and boxes I mean it's it's a lot of fun so how do you play well you've got all of these modes you've got trainer challenge which is your it's kind of like tutorial, only you get stuff for it. So you've got trainer challenge, okay, you know, we're going to go in, we're going to do this. And that's when you learn how to play before you go up against real players. Then you've got versus mode, which obviously is exactly what it sounds. Ooh. It's where you take your decks, you can do theme decks. You can go into standard mode, which I have one standard deck right now, expanded legacy, so on and so forth. Special events, which is kind of like tournaments. Ooh. That's a nice one. Single elimination, three rounds. You know what? Let's do this one. Here we go. I've got the advantage. All right. There's really no big Pokemon in this deck, and that's one thing I do like. All right, we need to go ahead and start adding our energy. And this buddy right here, this Magnemite, he's going to be just a role-playing Pokemon, if that makes sense. You know, he's not really gonna do a whole lot. So we wanna go ahead and we wanna do that. All right, now let's attack. Let's see if we can get lucky. 10 damage, and it's better than nothing. It's better than last round, right? Yep, there it is. Ooh. Things are about to get rough on us. Oof. <laughs> That's a bit of a waste, buddy. That, that really is, that's a bit of a waste. Okay, now this is what we were expecting. Oh crap, that's not what I wanted at all. Give him a sacrifice. <sighs> Things are gonna get bad quick if I don't start getting some energy. Because he's about to mess my world up. I mean, I'm basically just giving it to him. 
I don't get an energy this turn, it's all over. Whew. There it is. There it is. All right. Let's see, you're my lucky card. Look at that. Bam! Two in a row. We can't get this lucky every time. He's going to mess me up here in a minute. It's over, guys. He wins. Knocked out by a basic deck. How sad is that?